Hi, welcome to another edition of Real Estate Uncensored. Hi, you. Hi, you, honey. Hi, you. <laughs> Hi, you. Hey, today I want, I want to start out by saying, you know, uh, I, I, everybody talks about negative things, and I want to talk about a couple of quick positive feedbacks we got out of our lead department. You do know we have this phenomenal lead department where our customer service girls and uh, two kudos to great agents we have. Elaine Helms, uh, we got a note from one of her clients um, that said, we honestly didn't think we would have our, had our home um, if it wasn't for her, her. Wow, man, I can't speak this morning. That's okay, just say, oh, Sally sells. And, she's, she's, and of course, um, giving the customer service girls kudos by putting them in touch with her. Uh, that was one in Sean Bridgman. We just got one from him. Uh, once again, them telling the customer service, our lead department, thanks so much for setting us up with him. Mm -hmm. uh, he was phenomenal, done a great job. She thought the concept of the way we run our business is incredible, and she's going to refer um, everybody she knows out to us. So, uh, so good job, Elaine and Sean, and um, kudos to the customer service forward. girls, because um, we are giving excellent service, which reflects good on everybody. Who yeah, just for us. quickly, our lead department, which is um, one of a kind, nobody else has what we do. Just added another girl back there to help give you out leads. Mm -hmm. We have almost 10 million um, in office leads under contract. So uh, we're, we're looking for some more solid agents that want to make money and they get know into how to it. work. Um, and then quickly also touch on uh, we're closing in on 300 agents and we are stopping at around 350. Um, we are not going to go over 350 into our office. So if you guys want to come over and see why we're growing leaps and bounds and uh, number one company in production. In the Southeast Valley, come on over. Yes, um, we're excited call. about what God's doing for us. So, mm -hmm. um, a couple of things to think of: we're in November, so you should already be thinking about um, recapping your year and looking forward to the next year. And we want to encourage you to do some goal setting. We're going to have some opportunities in the office. Um, I'm sure there's oppor opportunities around the valley, um, but you need to take advantage of some of those opportunities. And I want to give some kudos to Nikki Janlevich and Marty Recht for a very creative way. Dynamic team. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're building a nice team. Um, they, they have a dynamic way that they decided to goal set. Um, they're really motivated by vacations. So they sat down with a, a, a travel agent. I know, me too. This sounds like a good idea. So they sat down with a travel agent, and they talked about their dreams about travel. And then they... Um, they said, okay, I hope to accomplish, I can accomplish this based on last year's performance. I hope to accomplish this step up. Maybe it's an upgrade or an additional vacation. Um, and they did like this. And if I get to this point, I can add this on. Or if I make um, X amount of dollars, I can um, add this trip. And so they've done, they broke down their vacations in terms of um, prospecting, sales, um, and things of that nature, and they are so excited to get out there and work. So when they wake up in the morning, they have to prospect. They don't think, i got to go prospect. They think, I need to work toward my vacation, and they fill in the blank. It's been very motivating for them. Well, that, that all stems to, you know, the bigger picture and why they do what they do. Mm -hmm. um, you need a reason. Any, a reason Can't be money. What's going to drive you and motivate you. Um, yeah, quickly, I also want to talk about referrals from irate clients. Um, you know... You do hear negative things. People do get pissed off for certain reasons. And quite honestly, we're human and we drop the ball sometimes. Are you yawning? Am I boring you? No, you said pissed off. Oh. Wait, say it again. Oh, it's better than peeing <laughs> pissed on. <laughs> um, so I got three tips. Three things you should do when you have an irate client. When they call up and complain about something, here's what you do. Say you're sorry. Right? Don't try to debate them. Don't try to stand, make your case. Just say you're sorry. Don't um, say I'm sorry, but. But. Don't say that. Take responsibility for what you do. Um, that's a huge thing. And then ask, how could you make it right? Ask them. And you know what? Those three things go a long way. Um, one of those things, that, one of my big pet peeves I've had over the last probably year that I've been working on is when you say you're going to do something and then uh, you don't do it and somebody calls you on it and they call you up a week later and go, oh, I was just about to call you. No, you weren't. You, you know what? I'll tell you, that, that's just insulting. So I've been personally working on because I know I'm not perfect. I'm just saying, you know what? I spaced it. Sorry, let's make it right. So just wanted to touch on that. Let's talk about some of the new agents in our office. Yes. Um, James and Todd Marlowe from 
DPR Realty, welcome aboard. And then Kim Layton, who's, who we've known forever, I'm so excited. Yeah, she, she came, was with us on our team. Yeah, so way awesome. back when. She's from, back with us. Valleywide Properties. Valley she's from. Wide, uh, um, Katie Cooley from Arizona Elite Properties, welcome aboard. <laughs> Come on. Terry Blackwood from Geneva Real Estate, welcome. Uh, Kristen Cohn from Gold Sold Realty. Elaine Reinert from uh, New Way Realty. You can't read my writing. No, his writing's tough. <laughs> Kathleen Jacobs from Prime Realty Group. Charlie Blackmore, there's another name we're so excited about. She's come over to head our transaction coordinator department division. Yeah, we have a professional transaction coordinator department. Yes. Wow, we're just given to these agents. Yes, we are. And uh, I don't know how to pronounce. I don't know if it's Rhea or Rhea. Rhea. I think it's probably Rhea. Rhea. And Janet. Mm -hmm. Well, welcome aboard. Um, quickly, I want to say also, we also have a, we run a real estate school out of our brokerage down in the South Chandler. Uh, every Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday night, Marty Baum runs it up. $199 to get your real estate license. Guys, if you know anybody who wants to get the real estate school, give us a call. Um, go to our website, agentsuccess101.com. And now, he's been breathing. <laughs> we have welcomed my son, Magical Matthew. He's back. Magical Matthew, you're going to help us with the game. Oh, do you have, is your lips a little chapped? A little chapped? Oh. Stand back. Uh, well, let's do the, for the awards, um, we're giving away $100 in gift cards, um, two restaurants. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Don't oh, yeah. <laughs> Kid, don't listen. But he's cute. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's pull out these numbers. So the winner show, this week. Show him the number so he can. Yeah! Oh, hey, don't go. What is that number? Zero. It's nine. It's nine. How about this yeah. one? Yeah, he doesn't go to school. It's zero. And this is five. Five. Ninety-five. 95. It's Where's zero, our list? Zero. Oh, Mike Wilner came close. He had ninety-four. Oh, you're my winner. No, he did not win. No winners this week, guys. You want to play? You pick two sets of numbers. Uh, go to agentsuccess101.com. We had lots of entries this lots time. Lots of entries. Good go job, to guys. Our, uh, Facebook fan page. Um, anywhere we can get us these numbers or info at agentsuccess101.com. Um, guys, if you want to hear about our company, uh, we just got Mindy Shields. She's now heading up uh, as business Director of Business Development. We're excited. Come meet her. Uh, come see what we have, guys. You guys have a great couple of weeks. We'll see you in a couple of weeks. God bless you. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Yes,